Here are Kindy's crucial clutch plays coming in as the new sniper main for Elevate in all of the major tournaments they have played so far this year. A bit of a disadvantage here because they don't exactly know where the players on the side of Elevate are and they are watching every single entrance. Now they're peeking out one. Looks like PG is going to be able to knock one down, but the trade comes through. It's your last clipper and he's going up against oh. Halo, but he's gonna win that gunfight. He has time to go in for the plant right now as Kendi is still doing his rotations around. Kendi finally reaches the side. Bomb gets planted right in time. Idra's looking the wrong direction. Will he be able to spawn? Yes, he gets it! The kill and the defuse comes easy. Yeah, two former teammates back in Smart Omega. Unfortunate, PJ's gonna be head of the bomb side. If they're holding things down, they go for the play. Oh, PJ no. finds the kill with an MP42. So Sano goes down. AG as well. And now we get to see it's gonna be at 1v1. AG to Wonder Boy. Can he win this round for the side of Solid Esports? Kendi is across the map. This is it. 1v1. Both former Omega. Both, both champions as Flash well. Bang. AG. Kendi. Cat and Mouse. Bomb will be down on A. Kendi has to run. 30 seconds left. AG planning the bomb. Definitely has the weapon of choice. Kendi has a sniper. He's trying to find some weapons. Kelly. 40 planted. seconds left. AG with an R9. Where do you try to take this route if you're AG? You planted that bomb at the A site. Timing. This flat crowd is everything. Take your time. You have lost the four rounds and you're dying to find one for your squad just Take to your keep time. yourself alive and avoid this game point. Oh, AG, oh, oh you sneaky, God. sneaky, sneaky. This the devil is unleashed. And right now, AG oh. is going to be here. This could be it. Kenny spots him with a quick scope. Takes him down. Match point for Elevate. Bomb defused. And that's going to be it, man. Elevate will be able to get information. He sprays it out to Tim immediately, getting another point. And Kenny takes down Jabin as well, leaving only two more plays to go. Oh, oh make it one. Whoopi, the last hope. He's going to need a Hail Mary. What has he got in the playbook? Slow on crawl on through. One oh. player left, Kendi. Worry about on the hallway. And looking like they are not going to be checking it at all. Wow. Still alive. Going to go for the Chow. Sun gets the flick. But does it really matter? It's now going to be Kendi's turn here with Sniper to take the spotlight away. Q9 is running out of time. Four more seconds left. Kendi denies. And it's going to be the first round granted to you by the side of Elevate. Wow. To just try to play through objective, you know for sure that the gunfights are going to be there. And you start to play this close range. But you got to be quick. You only have a minute and 15 seconds left to make this attack at the A side and you're currently down by five lives. Kenny's gonna be utilizing an R9 on this close range. That is gonna be deadly. Usually he's got a sniper, but that should do. Oh, he's missing that shot. He's gonna get spotted. Rushi's gonna have that War Machine invested. No, no, gonna be desperate to make the push on Courtyard. He wants to play for a spawn trap. Kalo's not gonna have a good time right here. Same lane that they're gonna be covered up. Stuns is gonna be there. And Kalo, he's gonna put wow. the punches onto No No and elevate. The four teams. Look at the live count here. Just going back and forth. Susano on a nine, eight kill spree there before he gets taken down. Candy, it's his turn to try to go for it as he gets that first shot coming through. 26 to 9. Oh. As his first shot comes through. Candy try to go for it. More kills coming through. Candy gets another one. Oh. Candy's a going. Oh. Last oh. fives remaining to go. There's gonna be 20 seconds left. Milky finally gets mixing that takes him down. Taste of his own medicine. If EJ's still on the inside, he is gonna be stunned. Looking for the wall bank. FTX hitting all angles. And unfortunately, he's not gonna be able to find another. Kendi able to strike on through on the back line. Kendi going big! He able to find the three piece to shut it out. We're tied up, chat. Oh man, what a timing there. Play for a full wave. Can go down. You know what's up? But Kendi on this mid map actually spots Lucy out. Looking to get some more. From the back, he gets the shot. Two more right around. One on the flush. He gets the shot connect. What's up? The mission pistol gets the connection as well. Ma here on top. Enough to get the shot down. All because of Kendi. Caught up here for his side of Glow. And will be able to find PD wow. as well. Should be the break. Triple kill for his side of Jackie. He's going to go down. The double tail comes wow. in. Kendi with an MG42 finds a double down. Two v two situation. Needs to move in quick. Yopi just needs to lay himself back at the back alley here. But they want to take this elimination stock to their wins then. And okay. now it's going to be a 1v1. Eight seconds left. You just have to buy time. And Kendi oh. wins it. Finds a double four piece to put Elevate. 
have eyes set definitely on that alpha. So Sanos just waiting probably for Bird to overextend. Oh, Kendi he misses for the oh first one, but God. that's the second my one. God. Oh! <laughs> Not really take care of the angles. And I'm just down to the last two players. Is Kendi gonna pick one up? Oh, no! Wow! The candy man with the two piece! Inside off the trailer side, Uling now gonna try to make a play, but Kendi destroys those last two players. It's Tower Esports, Skirt and FTX. This is the duo that we need to see step up here for the set of SCE. And they're gonna be what a part of me. Look at this. Oh my god, I, on the northern side. Yeah, it's just one v ones right here. I, I hate this. If you are Star Wars Esports, you gotta wait, take care wait. of that numbers. You gotta want to think about that work. Oh and no. now Scared is gonna take the elimination. It's Kendi! Oh, and the last player one situation is, is gonna be you on the situation. He knows. FDX has clutched one round already. He knows. From and the Kendi flight. just has the high ground! Oh! Oh! Kendi with this cup! Kendi with this cup! Look, it's two! It's a two versus two now! Marvel spots PJ. It's all up to Kendi. In a one versus two here. Kendi clutch up. Bomb's gonna go. Gonna drop now. Candy, a little bit of faster for retake. Remember, shotgun and, and and a sniper. The timing's everything. Spots one, he spots two, spots the first one. Candy gets second one. Two. Candy just have to go over. Gonna go for the quick scope. Oh. Just swaps back. Gets him a swap. Candy clutches up. And that's the last player. Relax, man. That's the last player. And there we go. Thirty seconds left. A three to five as we switch sides. Wow. Doable. But this one right here, Yopi and Clove. On terminal? Okay. Victor Corner's right. Oh, 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 oh. he oh just got turned on. It's a 1v2. Tell me you're not going to sell the bag. Close. Shut down. Perfect. Kendi. He wasn't hitting shots like that early, let me tell you. Pushing through for the side of Elevate, but are they doing just one to it wrestling? So far, Curly's getting with old goal for the tree. Three. Kendi points two. It's a 1v1. Curly, can he get the shutdown? No, he can. Kendi good for three. It's, that is your feet that you're going to have to deal with, and they do burn some heads with that elimination right there. Elevate is kind of worried whether they want to hold it down, but they do sort out the guy coming in from the front now. They're just going to have to worry about the team coming from their spawn. PJ. With it already in his hands, he has been really well with it. Susano gonna fall down, shot up with the stick down. But it's Candy on a 1v1. Who's gonna win the final? He brings up oh, the war machine to a gunfight! <laughs> Desperation for Element to win a round, and they bring it on! On the boxes, able to slip through. It's a 2v3. They have to take another guy down to equalize the number. But Joko's. Oh to my! And wow! What a shot! But Kendi! Wait, Kendi! Kendi! Gets two kills! He knows, he knows where he is! The Kendi spots him! He knows he's there! Joko's! Oh, oh wow. my! He backs up, it's a 1v1! Joko's versus Kendi! Two players have been to Worlds. 2022, that's where Joko's made a name for him. That takeoff, SD. But now here they come. 1v1, Kendi spots him on the right! He misses that shot! Goes for it, misses again. It's a 1v1 sniper. Kendi gets a hit marker. Just has to put one more shot on him. Yes, he can. Kendi with a 1v3 clutch. Sonic does have a war machine, but Yopi oh, is gonna have this Oh no! And that is a retention reverse for Elevate. It could be a three cap point. It could be a three man capture. They want to stack that point, but Marvel able to stop the hold here for war now. And Sonic, the war machine is not connecting. It's a 5v7. It is not going good. Candy with the shot down. One segment done. War Machine! The War Machine. Eight kills for him. With it already combined on this first six rounds. Yopi stops the push. Here we go. It all goes down to this. It's a 3v2. Oh, no. Yopi, they should be able to win through capture number four. Solo! So it's a 1v1! It's Hop a 1v1! On Hop on it! And Candy, we talked about the sniper. Oh no! Marvel. Just have to hop on it, Candy with this one. He hits it. Elevate takes it. Four to two, Elevate wins it. My goodness. What a control. Elevate, they close it out here. PJ, Candy, Tin, Risky, all eyes on you. The rescue is there. They want to bring the numbers back in their side. Elevate now, having the odds. Nade. But Risky with a god nade. Five to Donald and PJ. Candy. Pakakman, 
What are you gonna be able to do here? 1v2, the One. flag is on. He finds the flick. He finds the double. He closes the deal out. And I announce to you all, the champion, back to back, season five to season six. It's gonna be your boys from the Red Rebellion, Elevate. Candy takes down his former teammates. What do you guys think about Kendi's overall performance for Elevate this season? Let me know what you think down in the comments section.